Well, I'm getting the tent set up and uh, putting a couple of stakes in this tarp to make sure it doesn't blow away. There's just a slight wind, but all it takes is a little wind underneath that tarp. And I got a two pound hammer. There's a name for this, but I forget what it is. Peener or something like that. It's really nice. Nice soft handle on it. Yeah. So now I'm gonna put down the uh, Reflectix to insulate this floor. So I'll show you that. I've got it cut. And it should cover the whole tent floor. I mean, it does. I know it does. Slippery. Very slippery. How's it going on the camera? Looks good. Good. I put a line on the this reflectix. To get them even like. Well, turn this one over. Yeah, I think we're good. I better put something heavy on there. Okay. There we go. I'll just set some stakes on here to weigh it down. Uh, yeah, it's beautiful out here. So, get that tent set up now. The tarp, or the, uh, yeah, the tarp is uh, a little bit too small for my tent, but uh, I can cheat it a little bit. Okay. Get a couple more over there. Yeah, that, that's good.
Okay, get this tent up now before things blow away. I gotta take this jacket off. A little bit too warm for. There we go. This is a brand new tent. Yeah, it's uh, brand new. It's a warranty, a warranty tent. I uh, I called Coleman and uh, told him my screen doors was malfunctioning, and uh, before you know it, there was one in the mail to replace the one I had. So I feel pretty good about that. It was really. Very hard to use because the screen door would, uh, the zipper would come out of track, off the track. How's it looking in back there? rolling up on me there but yeah got her made <clears throat> I'm 
I might have to stake down this uh, reflectix, which wouldn't be bad. It would mean putting a hole in, hole in it in different spots. That it wouldn't be too bad. Well, let's see what we can do here. Perfect. <laughs> 